Hi guys and welcome back to Alistair Davis Golf. Today's video is all about rotation and how we can rotate through the golf ball better. I'm going to give you a simple drill that's going to give you some feel straight away to help you rotate through the golf ball better. So the benefit of rotating through the golf ball better is we will use our hands less. The more our body rotates, the more it delays the hand action through the golf ball and therefore gives us more a body release rather than the hand release. Generally speaking, this makes golfers more consistent, okay? There are some golfers that need more hand release because their body might not be able to do what I'm asking you to do. Those golfers were going to use a lot more wrist extension through the golf ball and a lot more club face rotation through the golf ball. And that's absolutely fine. I think it's important we know as a golfer what kind of golfer you are and what you need to play well. So today's drill, I must give some credit to George Gankers for this one. It's one I saw from him, I loved it, so I've pinched it. I did a similar one myself before, but I've just adapted it a little bit based on what he's done. So it's a great drill. So you might notice I've got a stick through my belt loops and I've also got a stick here. So the idea would be, and I've got a separate stick here, which I'm going to talk to you about in a second, but the idea would be that when I'm setting up to my golf ball, I'm going to put this stick behind me to give me the idea of if I rotate, I'm going to make contact with the second stick. So if I rotate correctly, I make that contact. And we can make this harder by stepping further away. We can step further towards target. So we have to rotate more to get back to it. But whatever happens, I'd want to see that we make some swings and we get that feel of rotating. So if I have the golf club here, I'm getting that kinesthetic feel all the time if I'm rotating or not. And ideally what I'd want to see is just being able to rotate and make contact with that stick before contact with the golf ball, which is tough, but that's the game. And ideally what you might do is set this up at home with some airflow balls, having to go at this drill. Can we rotate more? Can we rotate better? Now the second stick is there really to see if we can get our torso to try and match up. Now obviously we need a longer stick for this, but the idea would be try and match up the blue and the yellow stick and create the feel. Just make it a bit harder. Most top players are pretty matched through torso rotation and hip rotation through contact. So this drill will help us try and match that up. And again, potentially you could use a wall potentially behind you here and just try and get this to skim the wall, get this to skim the wall. That'll give you the same feels of how to rotate through the golf ball better. So let's see in action if we can, shall we? Just make it a little bit harder than that. Okay, so I'm gonna start with a small swing. You see that I just about nudged down the way through. I think if I'm honest, that's probably there just after contact. So I need to increase my rotation and do it a bit faster and a bit earlier for me in my golf swing. I know that anyway. I can definitely do with this drill a lot and it would definitely do me some good in my golf swing. So have a go at this rotation drill. Again, it's a great drill for anybody who needs more rotation, quiet down this hamster impact, and generally increase the kind of power as well through, through, the, through the hit and, and you know, increase their distance. If you've enjoyed the video, please click like down below. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. I've got regular content coming every single week on a variety of subjects. And please post any comments in the box, particularly of any videos you want me to cover in the future. And thank you for watching. I appreciate the support.